I'm Kevin Schmidt. I'm the Public Information Coordinator for Metro Water Services. And today we're going to be talking about your water service line. Your water service line is the line that connects your property to the public water main. Property owners are responsible for and own their water service line. It's extremely important to know the location of where the water service line connects to your home and the type of material that your water service line is. The easiest way to locate your water service line is to start at your meter box. Your meter box tends to be in the front yard, however it could be in a different location. From your meter box, what you want to do is draw a straight line back to your house. That is where your water service line generally connects. The general locations where your water service line may connect would be your garage, basement, or a crawl space. Now we're in the basement, and this is our water service line. This water service line is made of copper. Many water service lines have an emergency shutoff valve. An emergency shutoff valve allows you to quickly shut off water to your home or property in the case of an emergency. If your service line does not have an emergency shutoff valve, we recommend that you contact a plumber to have one installed and make all family members aware of its location. It could prevent damage and headaches in the future. Now we want to identify the type of pipe material used for your water service line. These tend to be plastic, PEX, copper, galvanized steel, and in some homes built before 1988, lead. Plastic, PEX, and copper can be identified visually. Plastic is a white, rigid pipe. PEX is also rigid. And copper pipe is the color of a penny. However, copper may have a greenish hue caused by tarnishing. Both galvanized steel and lead are dull silver gray pipes. You will need a strong magnet and a coin to help identify if it is galvanized steel or lead. First, take your magnet and place it to the pipe. If it clings, your pipe is galvanized steel. If the magnet does not cling to the pipe, it is probably lead. Lead is easily scratched with a coin and the scraped area will be shiny. If you have a lead service line, you should consider replacing the portion of the service line that you own, as well as any other household plumbing containing lead. 